Hey y'all and good morning. I am running late and the reason is because I um, I was taking my, my vitamins and I have a cholesterol pill and um, I dropped one. <laughs> I, dro I think I dropped it. I don't know for sure if I dropped it or not. But I thought I heard something hit the ground and I can't find it. And my cats are in the, there. It's it was in the kitchen, so the cats are in that area. So now I was like trying to find it, and I can't find it. But now, so now I'm late for this meeting that I was going to be there at 7:30. It's 7:45. So mm. <sighs> it's gonna be fine. I didn't drop it, or if I dropped it, I'll find it, and the cats won't find it, right? All right, let's go to the meeting. Not much really has happened today, aside from my morning meeting. I went to, it was Destination Downtown Boot Camp Information Meeting, and a couple of people showed up. Uh, we knew it was gonna be a low attendance just because their, um, the time that we had it and all that kind of stuff. So, and it was for like a, just a select area in Mesquite, the downtown area small area in comparison to how many business owners we may have in the entire city anyway so just a few people showed up but it was fine and it was good to hear his information and what the destination boot camp is all about so after that i came to the office and i've been working ever since i've been uh doing some instagram post prep and then i need to do more and I cleaned up some files, tried to remove some files from the computer to free up space. And then what did I do? Followed up on some emails. I mean, just like, you know, mundane office work. So Marvin is not getting off at two. It's 2.36 now. He did not get off at two. I don't know what time he's getting off. So I'm gonna run to the Dollar Tree on the north side of town, which is actually the side he works on and then I'm going to go home and I'm going to start working on cleaning my office because I have a little bit of time. I'm just going to do that until he gets home. And then when he gets home, then I'll just sit in the living room and work. But this is a great time. I was just kind of get, getting kind of like that. So I thought, you know what? I can go ahead and leave the office. I'll go to the Dollar Tree, pick up a couple things that I was looking at, and then head back home and just start cleaning. So, perfect. Perfect. Who doesn't want to clean on a Friday afternoon? You know what I'm saying? Because I'm not in San Antonio sitting on the Riverwalk drinking a margarita. This will probably be the next best thing. Because I'm feeling ambitious, I thought I'll stop at the storage unit and pick up a box or two. Now, I will probably regret this later. Here's where we're at with the storage unit. There is still stuff here, mostly office stuff, and I'm gonna have to really like think about that because I don't feel like there's that much space in the office to put that stuff. So I'm kind of like, so the house is bigger, we have more storage, but we have different storage. We have different, like where I'd normally put that, in the hallway, for example, in the old house, I had a built-in bookshelf. I put a ton of stuff on that, or a good amount of stuff. Not a ton, but a good amount. So, I don't have a place for that in the new house. There's not, not really a display area. But I've got Christmas in this corner, and it's mostly Christmas on like holiday decor there. But there are a couple, here. There are a couple of that see that blue box and that pink box down there those are like just upper attic storage and what's in them is just memorabilia i do need to go through them and see what i need to keep see if the kids want anything that i intended to toss and if not um then i'm tossing it so but again like there's a lot there's like a lot of boxes that are supposed to go in the office they're labeled office and i'm like Hmm, I don't know about that. In the office right now, I have it full enough. There are a lot of like um, 
photo albums and things like that, which I'm definitely not throwing away. Just not exactly sure where to store those. And I have um, some office decor because I did have quite a bit of decor in the house, like in the old house. And in this new house, I'm not displaying as much decor, but I still have some stuff that I want. So yeah, I'm just gonna go through it, purge what I don't want, don't need. I, have, I see board games are down there. Who doesn't like a good board game? I do. So I'm gonna haul this stuff to the car, these measly two boxes that I'm taking because I didn't want to like take four boxes home and then just get sidetracked doing those and not cleaning the office. So I'm just taking two boxes home, seeing what's in them and then just starting to tackle the office. So, but first we're gonna go to Dollar Tree. Second Dollar Tree that I'm in, the first one didn't have anything that I was looking for and I was only looking for a couple things. So now I'm at the second one, which is actually closer to my house, but it's hot outside. So I'm gonna go home after this. The shelves are always just so bare and I don't know how long this one has been open, but it's been open for like a couple years and they just never have anything. It's just always, always bare. So I doubt I'll find anything here. I did find some rope back there, which is used in a lot of craft pro projects on YouTube, but um, not what I came for. So I want to like the store. I mean, it's a Dollar Tree and they've got things for a dollar, so. But they only had one cashier and there was literally eight of us in line. And it's Friday afternoon and I wanna go home. <laughs> so it's kinda like, I ended up getting, I'll show you. Super quick Dollar Tree haul. I got this little glass jar. Isn't that cute? So I can put the cat treats in there. So, I thought that was handy dandy because I have been looking for something to put the cat treats in besides their just little pouch thing that it comes in because that's cuter, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> then I also got several boxes of these. These are a dollar. I saw another pack like from Glad that had 10. The, um, the off-brand had nine but you got two bonus ones so you got 11 and then this one had 13 i'm like okay so 13 is more than than either of those packs so i got these and then i got some hershey's kisses because i have peanut butter cookies at home and then i randomly got a red bandana don't like red but i want to kind of get used to wearing a bandana around my neck because uh the girlies have one and it looks cute on them. So I just want to see if like I'm going to like it. But I didn't want to spend like Carly Jean Los Angeles prices for a bandana that I don't end up wearing. So that's what I'm doing. Plus we have the rodeo here with Rodeo Capital of Texas. And so I could see where it would come in handy. Plus I saw a tutorial on how to make like one of those banners uh, or bunting things. And so our fireplace is a great would be a great place to put bunting and so I thought well maybe like after it gets settled in and all the boxes unpacked and all that stuff then I'll start hanging up like bunting and stuff like that and so anyway there you go that's what you do with that and I thought well I could hang up I could hang up bunting on the fireplace and like I could make it red white and blue because it had blue bandanas as well but this one, the girl, uh, the girl was telling me, she goes, I have no help. I don't even get to take a break. And I'm like, what? <laughs> That's like so crazy. And you know, I mean, I'm sure she's tired. People complaining like it's her fault that there isn't help and there's no stock on the shelves, you know, or that there is some stock on the shelves, but it's not very ample. So anyway, it's just a little bit after four. Marvin is already home. So I'm going to go home. I think I'm going to make us some pizza and see what we get up to then. Hey everybody, it is tonight, later tonight, later today, it's 10 o'clock, and I'm gonna get ready for bed. It's 10.30. <laughs> I was hoping to be in bed earlier, but that's okay. So, um, this evening I sorted through two, why is this not, okay. It wasn't, the door wasn't closing. I sorted through two boxes of like photos and just like keepsake stuff and I 
threw away almost half. So it's good though. It's good. I'm only keeping stuff that's uh, I'm trying not to make. I'm trying to make sure that I'm not keeping like duplicate pictures, which I'm sure I am, because I've had a lot of duplicates, and triplicates, and quadruplicates. <laughs> so I have a lot of pictures, but because my intention was to give like a set to each kid and all that kind of stuff. And anyway, so I'm um, coming across things like I came across a blue ribbon that Anna won at a play day or field day or something like that. She doesn't want it. So I'm going to toss it and as I'm coming across things like that, I'm asking whoever it belongs to, I'm like, hey, do you want it? If you don't want it, it's okay, but I'm throwing it away. Or, you know, depending on what it is, I'm either going to throw it away or give it away or something. So I'm hoping to really purge down the stuff that we're keeping so that it's just not too much. And then I'm actually going to store it up in the, the attic because... Yeah, I don't, I mean, I have room downstairs. I have room here. I have a room. But like I was telling you guys earlier, I don't have, in the old house, I had that bookshelf and I had room for all these, um, what do you call them? Um, photo albums. And in the old house, I also had a closet, an extra hallway closet that I put all of the photo albums, the more photo albums and board games in. So... I don't have that space anymore, so I'm gonna have to figure out either where to store them or put them up in the attic too, which I don't like to do that because when the kids come over, then we could look at the photo albums. So I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have to look for a space around the house that I can either add like a small bookcase to and store those things or something. Um, I don't really wanna put it in my bedroom. Maybe I'll put it some sort of bookcase in the spare bedroom. Maybe I'll do that, I don't know. But anyway, that's what I'm gonna work on this weekend and I'm gonna upload some more videos. I'm gonna work on purging stuff and I'm gonna empty that box that's in my car that I haven't brought in the house yet. And yeah, just relax though, other than that. I mean, relax as far as like, we're not gonna go anywhere really or anything like that, so. I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog now. I appreciate you guys watching. I hope you're having an awesome day or awesome night whenever you're watching this. Don't forget, be kind to others, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.